All right, welcome guys to a, another segment of training. Uh, what I'm going to do today is go over a few steps in Facebook training. Um, so, of course, uh, we've all heard of Facebook, and uh, this is definitely by far, if you are in business, in any kind of business, doesn't matter if it's the type of business that we're doing or if you have a traditional business, a storefront, a corporation, small company, you have to be on Facebook. You have to be to be successful in your business to get uh, access to a lot of people. So that's what Facebook does. So uh, we, I think a lot of us that are looking at this video really know what Facebook is all about. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, of course, uh, Facebook, you know, um, if you have an account, go, of course, just go ahead and sign in right here. You sign in right up here at the top. If you don't have a Facebook account, well, if you go to Facebook.com, it's going to take you to this page here. And this is where you'll need to fill out this information here. It, again, if you do not have a Facebook account, guys, you definitely have to do this. Uh, it will definitely help you in business. It'll keep you connected and uh, and put you in front of a lot of people. Because in this business, it's all about exposure. Um, so you want to go where people are at. And, of course, everybody or typically most people um, um, today are typically on Facebook, either on their cell phone, on their computer, things of that nature. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in. I'm going to try here and not going to try to keep everything long here. So as you can see, I'm in Facebook now. Uh, of course, I've got a few status updates here and there. And i got a few things I'm going to share with you. Of course, you definitely need to have your videos. So of course, we kind of went over a few things uh, in the other training on how to uh, upload a video and things of that nature. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to copy one of these actual videos that I actually have. So I'm, I'm going to show you how people ask me all the time, well, how can I get my video on YouTube uh, or on Facebook from YouTube, things of that nature, or even links? Uh, I'm going to show you how you can actually do a lot of that in this particular video. So for example, this is, uh, this is YouTube here, and I've got two links right up here, right? And um, so if I click on my, here's my YouTube link, and here's my Facebook page. So I'm just kind of going to go back and forth a little bit between these two pages here. Um, so I'm going to go to this particular video here. I'm just going to click on it. And of course it's going to come up. I'm just going to pause it. I'm not really don't want it to go through the video. And I'm going to come up here, up here at the top. This is the actual URL address for this particular video right here. So I'm just going to come up here and I'm going to right click and copy this video. And then I'm going to come back into Facebook. And if I go to Facebook here, uh, I can actually copy this information. I'm going to do something here. Let's see here. So, for example, and I'm going to show you what I just did here in a second. But let's say here, and uh, I want to go ahead and paste that URL address or that YouTube link there. Now, check that out. See how it just shows the, the picture of the video or the thumbnail of the video. And there's the information that that is coming from that video and there's the title of that video and I can actually I can actually delete this this is actually just the web address if I want to delete that I can click that and that deletes that address but guess what it still keeps the video right here if I didn't want to keep this video here I can click on the X button here and that will actually delete it but I want to keep that there and maybe I might want to type in a message here um, I could just put let's say hey check out hey Check out, uh, let's do it like this. Hey, check out my new video. <clears throat> dot, dot, dot. And now that's what I'm going to say in this particular status update. You can say whatever you want to say, because uh, mainly what, what's going to be said is really in the video. So it really doesn't matter really what you say at the top. I mean, you can say things. <clears throat> Excuse me. You can say things that will, that will maybe attract people to click on the video. I mean, you can say pretty much anything. But I try to keep it normal. I don't really want to do a sales pitch in my status updates. I try to do any type of, you know, whatever I want to, whatever the message I'm trying to, to get over to the person that's actually looking on this particular video. I try to just leave, let the video do most of it. And up here, I just try to just say something simple just to keep it, you know, keep it normal. So. Hey, check out my new vi my video. So if I click on post here, 
and we give it a second here and boom and there it is and and as you can see I just posted it up and uh, oh, Facebook has a new feature here promote this post now you can promote posts and move your important news links and photos higher in news feed this post will be marked as sponsored interesting so I might have to come back to that well what we'll do I, I know what this is about because I heard they were coming out with something like this uh, when you go on there maybe check it out yourself but I'm gonna just keep it simple here so we can check it out so as you can see I just did a uh, an update so now people that I'm friends with uh, will actually see that particular post so it's a uh, pretty pretty exciting when you're actually doing that and, and of course I can definitely put web web links there as well so if I wanted to type in you know my my website here MCA paychecks dot com oh. would help if I spell it right there right you can put your web links there as well and it is show information so you just pretty much do anything in the status update field this little field here this is where you can update anything that you want to say anything that you want to share you can give your your you can put your links here your video links you can even upload photos and videos here as well I mean you can pretty much do everything in this particular field uh, when you're trying to share information so it's, it's really 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 important that that you definitely take advantage of, of posting information and you know to your friends and things of that nature now one thing that, that one thing that I did earlier is of course this is my regular if I go to the home page here this is my regular news feed. I have all my different, you know, people, friends, family, you know, anytime they post anything up, it always shows up in this list here. But I know some of us have maybe a hundred, five hundred, a thousand, couple thousand, maybe almost five thousand friends. And maybe you just want to strategically promote your particular, you know, ad or video that you just created. Maybe you don't want everybody to see it. Maybe it's just only a certain group of people that you want to expose to this program of course the more the merrier but we all have people that hey you know I might not want to give them that information or whatever however you want to edit it well guess what there's a way that you can do it now keep in mind the more the merrier though but if you want to you know strategically market certain things to certain people maybe certain people you might want to share the membership with maybe certain people you want to share both the opportunity and the membership whatever you want to do you can definitely do that now check this out if I go down on the left hand side, of course on the left hand side of your Facebook page you see a lot of different information here. And we're going to go over a few things here real quick as well. And if you notice here I have my friends section here. Okay, If you don't see your friends section, make sure you go to your settings and make sure that that is visible so you can actually see that. But I have mine visible and typically I think it defaults to where you can see it. And what this is, it allows you to create a friend list. So like for example, if I click on more, it brings up all, a lot of different friend lists that I've actually already created. And I did one here earlier called test list. I'm just wanting to show you guys how it can actually work. So if I click on that list, what it does is it, it will only show people that I've added to this particular list. Now here's the thing. Anytime I post an ad or a video or, or just a, my thoughts or whatever, it will only go to to those individuals that are in the list so for example over here if you look on this list I have 15 people associated with this particular list so meaning that video that I just posted only these people actually will be able to see that video in their news feed okay see how important that is so I can put a hundred five hundred or however many people that I want if I want to do more targeted marketing of the people that are part of my Facebook account okay so that, that's how you can definitely do that so of course the way that you can do that of course you just go to the friends section you can click on more and then there's a section up here that says create list and then if I create a list let's just do one here um, we'll call it uh, MCA training okay and MCA training and I'll just go ahead and create because I'm going to show you how you can add members to this particular list here so if I hit create and then it shows there so now if you look here in my friends section here again there's MCA training right here 
And as you can see, I don't have any friends on this list yet. So if I put a post, if I set a, if I put a picture or a video here and I hit send, of course it's not going to go to anybody because I don't have any people associated with MCA training with this particular list. So what I can do is hit where it says add friends. And guess what? All my friends come up and check this out. This is how easy it is. You know, um, I could just click, click different people. How, you know, and you can go down your list. I don't know how many people that you might have. You might want to do a little bit at a time, or you, if you want to do all of them, you know, it's totally up to you. So this is how you guys can really be a little bit more strategic in terms of posting your information on Facebook. So, you know, I'm just clicking away here just so just to show you how it works. And and let's say I've gotten everybody that I want, and I can click on finish. And when I hit finish, guess what? Now I'm still in MCA training, but guess what happened? It's showing me all the different posts, and she's posting a lot of stuff there from uh, from all the different people here. So yeah, and Candace, she she's actually putting a lot of stuff on here. So, <laughs> but as you can see, if I go down the list here, there's some additional people here that that are posting ads or not ads or just just you know just posting information. So it shows that in the news feed for MCA training. If I decided to go ahead and you know copy another video here, well, guess what? Those individuals only here will see this video. So it gives you a much more control over the type of marketing that you're doing. So maybe you don't want to send it to everybody. Maybe there's only specific people that you always want to send your information to or certain types of information to. Okay, Matter of fact, you can even create a list for your team. So if you create a list for your team and you're posting up ads on training and things of that nature, you can do that. So guys, this is a really good helpful tool to kind of help you, you know, manage the type of marketing that you're doing based on the the, the amount of people that you have in your friend list. So right now I've got uh, I don't have a lot of people in my friend list because I do a lot of marketing outside of my my market. I think I've got like about 600 people, 599 people in my friend list. So about 600 people. I've seen people that you know have a whole lot more than what I have and uh, and I've actually made a commitment to I want to definitely um, get thousands of friends so I'm always accepting a lot of people and I'll show you some other things in the future how to get more friends as well so so I hope you guys got that in that portion of the training so far I'm gonna show you something else that's really good so yeah I've only got about 600 people in my Facebook friend list you know on you know on this account however I do a lot of marketing outside of my 600 friends on uh, on Facebook and I know what you're saying well Steve how do you do that well check this out there's a deal called groups people make groups all the time a lot of you guys are a part of the the double up Friday club group that has well over 9,000 members okay well you can definitely accept or get you know or join other groups out there on Facebook as you can see I'm actually part of a lot of groups here and that again is on the left hand side of your Facebook page you should so once you start adding groups to your account you'll see them uh, represented right here on the left hand side so if I click on if I'm on the group section here and I click on more it's gonna show you all the different groups that I'm a part of and this is what I typically will do when I am a part of a lot of these groups I will go in here let's say for example this particular group post your opportunity here so if I click on that it brings up this list or group per se and in this group there are over 4,000 people in this group okay 4,025 members in this group okay so meaning when I do this right here hey guys check out my new video let's say on the Las Vegas strip post see that guys so now that video is now visible to all those 4,000 people Okay, so if they're online right now, so the people that are on this particular group right now as I am speaking, guess what? They just saw this ad or status update post up on their on their computer. So 
Some of them might click on it. Some might not click on it. Some might just look over it and move on to the other, the other things that other people are posting about different opportunities and things of that nature. Okay, see how powerful that is. So I don't care if you got one or two people in your Facebook. I had a person that called me. Um, I think it was yesterday, I believe, and they said, "Well, I don't have a lot of people in my, you know, in my Facebook. I don't, I don't know if I'll be able to do this." Well, you know, I said, no, you'll be able to do this no matter what, because every time you log into Facebook, you're, you still have access to hundreds, if not millions, if almost a billion people you have access to. In this case here, even if you just had two people in your Facebook friend list, you can come here, be, be a member of this group and still have access to over 4,000 people. How powerful is that? You just have to be a member of Facebook to be able to do that. So pretty incredible stuff, guys. So I'm going to go back here and show you again so I went to that one let's do let's do another one this is a work from home group that I'm a part of and I'm gonna show you how to set these these groups up this one has over 3,000 members so guess what I'm gonna do the same thing and a matter of fact I might just copy that just to make it I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do here hey guys check out my new video on the Las Vegas Strip. Okay, and what I'm going to do, you'll see what I'm doing here. I'm just going to copy both of those, but I'm just going to delete this piece and do post. See that? I check this out. I'm not done yet. See, I'm doing some marketing while I'm doing some training. Look at that. Isn't that something? So here's another one here. This is a different one. See what I did? See how easy I just did that? This one has 121 members. And I'm going to go back to more again. And I could just hit the back key and it'll take me right back to it, though. Uh, so that was work at home. Let's do a different one. Let's, what's this one right here? Network marketing. What's that one about? This one has 4,800 people. I think it's closed, though. So you see, it won't even let me do any uh, any uh, post any ads or anything on that one. Uh, so let me go back away for that one and see. I got a couple other ones here. Here's another one here. This one has 416 people. And let me see. Bam. So guys, you see what I'm doing here? I'm I'm doing advertising and I'm marketing to thousands of people right now. How long did that take me? I don't know what. Couple minutes, if that. You know, it might even, it might not even take me but maybe another minute just to do the rest of those groups. So I'm not going to do that now. Um, I'll do it after after I finish with the training. Okay, so um, as you can see, that's how you can do that. So how do you get these groups? Well, one way you can do that, uh, you all have access to a search bar right here on your Facebook page. Here, um, it, it, it always shows up here at the top. And let me show you how that how this works. Let's say, for example, you wanted to join some of these groups. You can type in work from home. Okay, when you type in that, whatever the phrase is, don't hit enter just yet. Come all the way down and hit see more results. So if I click on that, what it's going to do is going to bring up my search filters uh, right here on the side. So it ha where I have people, if I click on that, it's going to show me people that have some type of work from home phrase associated with their Facebook account. Okay, which is good. You can add friends. That's how you can add friends that are in the same mindset as you. So if you need more friends and and people that are already have the the business mindset or looking for opportunities to to earn extra income or what have you, you know, this is a perfect way to do that. And uh, pages, people that make fan fan pages. I'm gonna show you how to do that in another training. A uh, very very powerful you know strategic uh, uh, method on in terms of getting a lot of likes and people and uh, you know add it to your network uh, let's see so we want to go here but we want to go to groups right here so if I click on groups guess what pops up a lot of different work from home groups and then all you have to do is what join the group 
And if you want to see what the group is all about before you join it, just click on the actual link here. And then it pops up and then it gives you like a little insight on the type of people that are involved in this particular work from home group. And guess what? You can join them. So you know what I'm going to do? Let me hit the back key. I'm going to join this group. It's about 1,400 people, 1,459 members of this group. Well, guess what? I'm, I'm going to join them. Okay. So I just joined the group and I'll, get, I'll later on, I'll get a, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, guys. Later on, I get a, uh, a notification uh, alerting me that I've been added to the group. Once I get the notification that I've been added to the to the group, you'll see that I'll be able to do, you know, status updates and things of that nature. So that's what you sometimes you just have to wait for the administrator of the group to give you complete access so you can actually start adding, you know, um, you know, content to the group. So that's pretty much what you do, guys. You just go down, go down the list or whatever, and, and just go from there. Let's say you you pick a few of these and you want to do a different one. Um, Maybe you want to join a single mom's group, okay? Uh, if, if you click in, you know, type in single mom and then go down to the bottom here and hit the search field, you'll see a lot of different single mom and I think even single dad groups as well. So a lot of good information there. Um, let's see, make money from home. Make money from home. Again, come down here hit the search field and guess what brings up a lot of different groups okay you can click see more a lot of different make money uh, from home let me see let me see uh, make money online you, you see guys I'm just making this stuff up and it's always people you know thinking the same way and that's why they make these groups so if I click on the field at the bottom there's a lot of different ones here. Here's one, Make Money Online. It has about 2,700 people. This one has over 3,000. Let me take a quick look at that one. Pretty interesting. Good stuff here. These are people that I want to be a part of, right? So you know what I'm going to do? I'll probably just go ahead and join it, right? And then all I'm, what am I doing now? I'm just waiting for what? The approval so whoever runs this particular group, I get a notification later on today sometime or whenever saying that I've been added to the group. And then once I get added to the group, then like say for example, to kind of give you an idea again, so if I go back to one of my other groups that I'm already added to, this field will open up. But not until then. So I have to, you have to get added first. For well first you have to, you know, request to, to join the group and then after that you can uh, um you know, you can actually, you know, once you get accepted, you can actually go in and, and, and start start posting a lot of information. So great tips, guys. Uh, just wanted to share that information with you in terms of how the groups actually works and and how you can definitely take advantage of a lot of these particular groups. Um, let's see here. Just wanted to kind of get a quick little glance there at the, you know, at the bottom on how you can definitely do that. So so again, guys, this is Facebook. It could definitely help you make a lot of money. It could definitely take you outside of your existing market. Okay, so you definitely want to do whatever you can to to really take advantage of of what this thing is all about. So Facebook can, can really help you really make a lot of money. Take advantage of those groups. You know, uh, definitely. And if you need to be more strategic in your in your posting, if you want in terms of your people that you already have in your Facebook uh, friend list, and say you got a couple thousand or you know, 100 or whatever, if you want to be more specific on who sees some of your ads and don't see some of your ads, you know, you can go back to, you know, setting up that friend list that I showed you guys how to do that. So uh, that's enough for now. Um, I've got another uh, uh, segment that I'm going to show you on how to actually get some additional uh, views and, and hits to your websites and things of that nature. So, hey, we'll see you guys on the next video. Have a great day.